What's up everybody and welcome to another eSync webinar. So in this webinar I want to speak with you about Europe markets which eSync support with everything such as pricing, full automation with orders, FBE of course and such more more and more stuff that we are giving to all our customers which are already using all the Europe markets. So let's dive in. So as you guys know, uh, a lot of dropshippers selling right now and also before in the biggest markets such uh, US. But if you can see, we support all the marketplaces here on eBay and also in uh, uh, without API, also some of them, and uh, of course in Shopify. And we want to show you why you should do it today and what you need to know before you starting to selling in markets uh, such as France or Italy or Belgium or Germany. And in my example, uh, I will show you how it works in Italian stores. So as you know, you just have to connect your eBay store. It can be, for example, you selling before on uh, ebay.com, but as you know, you can log in with your ebay.com in any marketplace, in Italy, in French, in Germany. So in our webinar, our example will be uh, eBay Italia, and I will show you what I did exactly. I will go to my Go login and open this browser, and you will see that I'm already applied some items, but before you upload an items to this European market, I will show you step by step what the necessary things you have to do before you start to selling there. So this is my seller hub. Um, yes, it's in Italian, but if you know how to work in the US market, it's pretty much the same seller hub. And if you don't understand anything in Italian, it's okay. You always can do Google Translate. And also you can communicate with your customers in Italian and using Google Translate. It's such a not a big deal. So as you can see, the currency is in Euro. But if you came from the US, so it was in USD. But what you have to do right now uh, is going to help. Um, yes, help and search for change billing currency and once you click on change billing currency you will get the message here to change it to euro or pound or whatever you want i'm already did this before so uh, ebay allow you to do it just one time in 12 months and if you don't have the option just open the chat with them or call them and say hey i want to sell in french or in germany or in italia so please change my currency to uh, euro because I don't want to pay extra uh, fees from US dollars to um, euro. So this is very necessary market, guys, that you have to change your currency. So we already did it before. And now I want to show you the subscriptions. Also, the <clears throat> subscription prices is very convenient. Uh, if you uh, check, uh, we have base, premium, and premium plus. And what you get in base, up to 300 items. Premium, it's up to 10,000 items. And unlimited plan, it's the premium plus. As you can see, the prices here is more, more or less like in USA. In my opinion, it's even less. So check this and you will see and you have to choose your store. Also, another thing that I want to speak with you, it's about the template. We have a missing here, a very useful uh, template, and you can change it by HTML. It's a little bit tricky here, but you can find all the necessary stuff. Here we have the HTML. There is no much knowledge that you have to know to change uh, some stuff here. It's very easy. And you can choose what to write here based on your policy. 
For example, I write in here that we guarantee returns in within 16 days, you can do it in 30 days, whatever you want. Uh, once you change here, it's very responsible and you will see this immediately that it changed to 30. So guys, play with this and choose your um, template and just make sure you save it. Also about the repricing. When you came to repricing, just make sure you choose your marketplace. For me, it was Amazon Italy. You can choose quantity and stock, shipping times. Um, it's not affect your policy. It's just about the repricing uh, from Amazon to your uh, eBay listings. You can put your uh, profit here. My example, it was just 10% and so it's the same as you see and you already know in your US market, just make sure you save it. And then you can go and create your listings and upload your listings. I already did it before. As you can see, I'm already upload some items here and it looks the same as in USA markets, just in Italia. Another last thing that I want to show you here, if we go and order some stuff in Amazon or if you allow us to do it with FBE, we're not paying tax for items. It's another benefit <clears throat> to work in your markets. For example, this item was 1979. If I click on details, you can see the price is the same and he no change. We don't pay extra tax and it's already with all the items in Europe. Guys, if you're going to like this video and if you have more questions, please just ask me in the comments below. And if you like this series, I will do another webinars about this with more details and more, more, more options to do and how to sell in your market. Bye bye from me and thank you for watching our webinars and see you in the next webinars.